Hey guys, so what's up? So today we're going to be doing, as you saw in the title, a review on my Mighty Bite that I just got yesterday. So let's get started. So as you can see, all the Mighty Bite is in this box. It does not come with the box. The purchase of your Mighty Bite does not come with the box. But I just purchased this at my local Walmart, just the closest place I was at. Just got a quick little sheet box. So let's open it up. Alright, so as you can see, they're all in here. Instructions, all the little fishes, all the little pieces. Um, so let's get started. Let's start with the fish. So, as you can see here, we have a fish right here that it comes with. Um, this is just a yellow one. It does yellow and white. It's got a little blood marker right there. This one does not come with a hook in it. It's more for deeper depth of water. And then right here we have another one of those. That one's golden. Golden white. More for like not as dirty water. The yellow brighter ones for the dirtier water. I'll show you how all the pieces fit in them uh, when I get to the ones that would be easier. Right here we have one. I know these, this one looks kind of like it, exactly the same. Except this one has a hook in it. And this one is for higher depths of water. That's just a white one with the little blood. All of them have that little blood thing by the way. So you can insert the pieces. Here is a yellow and white one. With the little blood thing. Yellow on the top. The hook's a little bit yellow there. Comes with the hook. All the rest of these come with the hook by the way. Alright so right here. I've kind of already put the fins in this one. Here's just a nice size fish. Little bait. Uh, this is black and grayish, whitish. With the hook in it. Here's another one, same size. Golden. Not, definitely a good fish for the lighter colored water. Here is a smaller fish. I think the smallest purchase you get in the the smallest bait you get in this, it's a golden and clear. Most of these are the same colors. Right here we have our same size yellow and clear, white, whatever. Okay, so these are a little bit bigger, fatter. Same length though. Um, here's a golden one. It's the same length as the one I just showed you. And here's a yellow and clear and white one. Alright, let's move on to our attachment. Alright guys, so let's start out with these first. What these do is make it where the fish can smell. And when they do grab on, if they do grab on, they won't let go because it makes them taste better. So what you what you do is it's very simple. You just take a little piece of it, just like this one. What you do is you just slide it in there. It's very cool. And this little pocket here, there's all these little inserts. This one's kind of messed up, so it may not be able to go all the way. But... As you can see, if you can see that, see I just slid it right in there. It had a perfect little hole for it. Alright, so let's move on to our next thing. Alright, so these things right here. So what these do, oops, grab the wrong one. Alright, so what these do is these make it where it's like, sounds like, have you ever heard of rattle trap bait? Rattle trap bait has these little beads in it and it kind of sounds like, can, I don't know if you guys can hear that, but be quiet. It makes it like sound like it's rattle trap bait. So what you can do here is I took that other stuff out. You can just insert this in the back one. Just this side first. And watch this guys. Just enter that back there. And boom, now they can not only taste the fish and smell him, but they can also hear him. 
I don't know if you guys can hear that, but I'm trying to shake them. Alright, so let's move on to our next attachment. Alright, moving on to our next attachment. So let's say you you don't think it's going deep enough for the kind of fish that you want. Because you can catch catfish with these. So what, you, what you're going to want to do is they have these weight attachments. And you just can stick it down in there. And then, and now your fishy can go even deeper. As you can see, it's in there. Sorry, it's kind of blurry, guys. So, now your fish can swim deeper. Now, here's another great way to control how deep or how high you want your fish to swim in the water. What these are are fins. Now what you what you want to do is you want to enter them right through there. And here's the trick. So the bigger ones will make your fish swim higher and the smaller ones, see there's different sizes in here. The smaller ones will make your fish go deeper. So I'm just going to put the big one in really quick and then show you guys. Now, as you can see, he has fins, and the fins even will swim like real fish, like, they'll go like that, and all that, they'll go up and down, and now you control how deep, and how, how low, and how high you want them in the water. Now, I'm not going to spend too much time on these, because all these do is they keep in the fins, what you do is you just take them, stick them in in the bottom, and there's a little hole in the fins, and it keeps them in there. Now what this is, is this makes your fish kind of swim right on top of the water. It's kind of a flotation device that makes the top water fish bite them like crazy. So what you do is, there's a little hook on this thing. As you can see right there. And then you just put it on the, uh, the fish. And now it'll be a, like a top water bait. Alright guys, so what I've done is I've just showed you guys an example, so this thing would just be on top of the water, just be kind of dragging, not like directly on top of the water, but it'd be pretty close to the top of the water. Alright, here's our next attachments. So these cannot be put on all the fish, on, but what you are going to want to do, I'm not going to show you, you guys how to do it too well, but... Because you can't do it on this fish, but you enter it through that little middle hole. And then what you're going to want to do is you'll, some of the fish you'll get, the hole will end right there behind the hook. And you'll pull it up all the way up there. And then you'll take the end of this thing and you'll put it on the hook so it can't go anywhere. Kind of like this after you drove it through the hole. Just going to want to put it on the hook. And it'll slide all the way down. And then it's nice and safe on there. Alright, now on to our next things. Uh, comes with a little guide on which bait to use for which fish. And instructions. And then it comes with four additional big hooks. Just for those fish that didn't come with hooks. And you can put those in there for like this one all right guys so that'll be it tune in because i will be doing a video using this bait so i'll see you guys later thanks for watching make sure to comment like and subscribe